thinking this hill might be a little bit too either either it's too steep for the Bradley or I just don't have enough experience right now to mess with it um, I did slide a little bit and um, it, when it starts sliding it's just kind of for me I just kind of panicked a little bit don't know really why but I let go of the controls and it cut off and uh, sorry that you guys didn't get to see any of that because the camera fell over for some reason. But uh, yeah, so it did it did all right actually. And I'm um, I'm not sure how I would mow this if I would mow it straight up and down or not. I don't know. I mean, some of you guys that mow hills, let me know how you guys do it. But uh, yeah, I think what I'm gonna do is probably break out the hustler and just mow with that this is about let me see i got two properties that's really steep like this and one of them of course is mine and then the other one is one of my neighbors or not my neighbors but one of my uh clients which you guys have seen um so i'm just curious to know how that one is going how my mower is going to do um uh, on that property but I mean, guys, this thing is a clean cut. So I'm really impressed with the Bradley so far. Uh, I still got to get all that, that grass up there. So I think what I'm going to do is break out my Hustler. Because I know I can at least go up and down it with it. This one I'm not too familiar with. And I don't want to try it just yet. And I know the other day when I was just kind of messing around with it. I tried going up the hill and the front end lifted up. And I'm not sure if that normal when you're going to peels with uh stand on more so i think i'm gonna leave that alone for now and just get my hustler out and just knock it back down and uh just try to try to make it look pretty good all right guys Let's see what we got now i will say this as well um my hustler does slide down the hill um quite a bit so it's not like a perfect cut but uh, it does slide down the hill. I can go up it, I can go up the hill, I can go over, and I can come down. I'm not sure if I can do that with this yet, and I'm not willing to try that just yet. I want to get a little bit more comfortable with it. I've been driving it, um, I guess it's been a week now, roughly. And so I'm not willing to try that just yet. But it's coming, it's coming, guys. Um, just got to be patient with me and let me learn the machine. I've never driven a stand on machine before, uh, other than this one. Um, I did dim I did drive one when I was at the place, but I mean, it was really slow and awkward because you know, you got three or four people looking at you and you've never done it before. So, um, but now that I've actually been able to kind of play around with it and drive it around and cut some yards with it it's not as hard actually it comes almost natural now so yep I'm gonna break out the hustler and uh, go ahead and mow the shit backyard because and normally I don't let it get that tall normally I have it cut right now uh, but my self repel mower is in the shop, and I need to get that out the shop. And hopefully, it'll be ready in the next coming weeks. Actually, I think it's ready now. I just gotta go get it. But anyway, uh, yeah, breaking out the hustler. So we're gonna get it done.
pretty much it. Um, I'll take the weed eater and knock that taller grass down. I might even take the blower and blow it, kind of spread it out. But uh, it's usually how I do it. I could have went back up and down a couple of times, but usually I try not to do that too many times. Just because it makes marks in the ground and it makes it look really bad. But I gotta do what I gotta do for the time being. So, yeah, the Bradley probably could do the same thing, and I'm sure it'll look a lot better and probably be able to control it a lot easier. But like I said, right now, I just, I'm just so, um, I don't want to say the word uh, nervous, but I'm just, uh, want to make sure that I can control it before uh, I start doing all of that. So anyway, I'm going to clean it up, make it look like something again, and uh, so you guys can finish a look on it. All right, everybody, this yard is done. As you can tell, everything's edged up neatly. Um, everything's cleaned up. I, uh, I edged the bed out again, but I didn't uh, get the weeds out today. I'm going to do that another day. I'm going to wait till some of these other grass uh, clippings kind of die. This thing was kind of tall, so some of the clippings went into the bed. Uh, and here's my heel. It's not perfect. It's all right. It's my heel, so no how to be. But uh, you can see everything's kind of cleaned up, looking pretty decent. Uh, and the other bit, I still got to bury this wire. Um, so yeah, I, it'll probably be closer to fall now. So I'm just so busy right now. Um, I do plan on putting more mulch in, and that'll probably be in August. Well, this is August. It'll probably be like maybe in two weeks. I'm gonna get some more mulch and pack it in, make it look good. So cool. Uh, this house right here. Uh, I, I think I got. I think I told you guys that it already sold. And uh, today, um, I've seen a couple go over there. They look like an older couple, but nevertheless, um, I will be sticking one of my door hangers on there in a few minutes. And uh, I'm trying to get that yard back. I seen somebody ride by yesterday and looking at that house. So hopefully I can get some action off of it. Real nice. And hopefully they don't want me to do the bushes again. They need to be done badly. Maybe they don't want me to keep my mulch going. I can get this yard back and maybe one of the two. Maybe this one. I might have just cut that yard. Don't look like it did, but it did. If I can get that one and that one to get over there across the street where I did the uh, tree trimming job on it, I think I'll be in good shape. So, anyway, guys, this has been a full day today. Um, I've done more than I thought I would do. Uh, and I've done more than I thought I would do and less than I thought I would do, if that makes sense. So, at some point I gotta get this truck and trailer cleaned up. Uh, don't think I'll have time tomorrow to do it. But, uh, yeah. We're supposed to get some rain today and tomorrow. Tonight and tomorrow. Uh, and I heard there was some sprinkles across town, but we didn't get anything over here. But anyway. Guys, as always, stay safe out there and keep grinding.